Hi guys, welcome back to Elite Media Alternative. So Ruma again, GeForce GTX 1080 8GB DDR5X based on Pascal GPU in May. Uh, well, at least I have a nice uh, juicy Ruma uh, just in time for the weekend. Asian-based uh, Bench Alive claims that Nvidia will release a Pascal architecture based GeForce GTX 1080 8GB DDR5 in, in May. Uh, it will make sense as the HBM2 will be available in, in volume only late in the year. These are precise dates being mentioned as well as uh, May 27th, four days prior to the Computertex exhibition. Obviously, NVIDIA is not going to comment in this rumor. The GP104 based GTX 1080 uh, would get a 256-bit um, memory controller tied to 8GB of DDR5X memory. The usage of DDR5X over regular DDR5 is rather spectacularly, sp spectacularly, as it isn't even in a volume production as as we know it, as, as we know it of. Uh, Microns, the only uh, one uh, with fab these DDR5X uh, eyes, announced in a recent blog uh, post that they have intended to commence high volume production DDR5X chips in mid 2016. Or sometimes in the summer, but who knows? Nvidia has gotten their hands on an early batch of couple of thousands of of, chip, of cards, right? DDR5X5 is a standard for DDR5 memory. However, opposed to delivering 32 bytes access to the memory cells, this is a double up towards 60, 64 byte access, and and that is in theory could double up graphic card memory perform memory bandwidth. Early indicators, according to uh, presentation show numbers with the memory capable of going up to 10 to, to uh, 12 gigabytes per second and it will feature 16 gigabytes uh, per second so so you high in graphic cards uh, these days however uh, I'd say 400 megabytes per second with DDR5X they could increase to 800 to 1000 megabytes per second and thus these are very significant significant improvements uh, actually are competitive enough uh, with HPM Pascal base, uh, uh, Pascal GPUs are faved in Taiwan semiconductor manufacturing company recently hit by earthquake based on the new 16nm FinFET um, process. 16 60nm should re uh, result in significant power savings. The card would only need uh, one A-pin connector uh, for power needs. The card will, will get a DVI, HD, HDMI, and two display ports. From the looks of the things, as 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 expected. Uh, this is not big Pascal GP100. The the GP uh, would get 17 billion transistors made in 16 nm FinFET plus node at uh, T, uh, TSMC and likely be HBM2 memory. Uh, so to re uh, recap, in the la in the latest uh, prognosis, Nvidia. Um, Rumored to launch a uh, first high-end GP104 GPUs with models GTX 980, GTX uh, 10, uh, no, 980, sorry, 1080, 1070. Um, should Nvidia use this naming scheme, these chips will come uh, in 37.5 times 37.5 millimeters BGA package and get uh, 2,152 uh, pins. So wow, there is so much excitement going on at the moment. But um, I didn't know that it's only going to have only one uh, A-pin connector, which is fucking going to to be fucking much better improvement from uh, current uh, Maxwell uh, graphic cards, and it's going to fucking of course help with the cable management as well. But I'm looking forward. Um, I mean, the closer we get to the May, um, the 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 more information is going to surface. But we see what's going to happen. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe for more. Thank you.